Guys, welcome back to Lafouche Parish. I tell you what, it is so great down here. You know, this is why God gave us Louisiana's Web in Between Our Toes, because some of us just love the bayou. And this morning, I'm here with Brent Daigle from Grady V's. Brent, I mean, you brought it this morning, huh? Thank you, sir. Yeah, definitely, definitely. We'll showcase a couple of our new dishes out here. Uh, we'll kind of run through them and kind of let you sure. taste them out there, right? So first of all, crab meat beignets, so local crab meat, cream cheese inside of a dough, deep fried, how bad could that be, right? And we got our boucherie plates, so really dear and dear to my heart. I'm from the, the Cajun country, so we do a lot of boucherie. So get some fresh smoked sausage, boudin, bacon, pulled pork, and a couple of little house-made oh, pickles yes. and things like that, right? How bad could that be, right? And we got a, a red bean hummus, so we kind of want to like do a little Cajun take on something more non-traditional, right? So it has the same flavor of red beans, but it's in a hummus form. We sort of what we call savory beignets, yeah. right? Because again, kind of whimsical. Yeah. And then we have our, uh, our showcase, which is our Cajun uh, redfish p roll. This is the beast. Definitely, definitely. So like, think about uh, a redfish taking a ride on some boudin down the down bayou of Flavortown, right? So uh, we got some nice boudin, a black and redfish, some fresh local shrimp, and a Dewey cream sauce. How important is it to have such fresh seafood? I think it's a, it's a hundred percent. I mean, I, I really. That's the flavor that everybody's so used to down here, so you have to have that. You can't come in here with some imported or different stuff. They, they, they're they used to that fresh stuff, they catch it. So you gotta make sure you're bringing the right stuff to the right table, you know? Oh, exactly much. So is this probably one of the most popular dishes that uh, fish yeah, and boudin? I think it definitely is. I mean, how bad could that be, right? Boudin, fish, it's the most Cajun thing you could possibly think of, right? Andouille in there, some shrimp. I mean, it's awesome. What's your favorite thing on the menu? Uh, I'm, I'm partial to the crammy beignets. I really love those. Uh, just because like, it was kind of fun to play around with that idea of like a savory beignet, not that powdered sugar sweet thing you used to get in New Orleans, you know? So. Now, now, I know it's raining outside and it's a little wet, but Peyton has been looking at this <laughs> back porch oh, tea. He's been, he's been eyeballing it, right? Yeah, so we're going to give that to him when we leave. But uh, we got a little back porch tea, so we make a homemade strawberry citrus syrup. It's got a little tea, some lemonade, and some uh, Tito's vodka, and a little Buffalo Trace bourbon in it. So at the end of the night, everybody's going home, you're winding down, what's your last bite of the night? Last bite of the night, I don't know, I'm probably hitting a little piece of bacon. And the bacon's always near and dear to everybody's heart, right? So why not? <laughs> I'll tell you, bacon is good. And I, I you know, it, it's fresh seafood is so important. Oh man, good, that right? sauce is killer. <laughs> that sauce. Well, thank you, thank you. Spend a lot of time in that. And you guys are just right there in Thibodeau. Yeah, about 15 minutes away or something like that. Not too bad. Wednesday lunch? Wednesday, well, Tuesday lunch? Tuesday Wednesday lunch. Wednesday through Saturday all day. All That's day it. long. Man, you can't beat that with get a stick. Get you a back porch tea, get you a redfish, go to town, man. I tell you what, man, thank you so much for hanging out with us this thank morning. You, I tell you what, you know the only thing, gang, that goes great with this is a little music. <laughs> 